What's up guys, Patriots here, and this is a new series I'm starting called Being a Pro with Patriots. And, uh, if you're not into being a pro, then, uh, this gameplay is not for you. And, um, yeah, so, we got a Scar, Silence, Scavenger, Stopping Power, um, maybe, yeah, I think it's Stopping Power, I don't even know. Screw the class, who cares the classes, you guys have just about seen everything by this point. Um... Yeah, I think I was trying to see what the frig killed me that fast. Um, anyway, though, I don't know why I'm standing here and not moving. But, um, yeah, so I haven't done a commentary in forever. But that's because I've been trying to avoid uploading a commentary over the Quickscope tournament video. Which I've been told many times was going to be out the next day or the day after. I'm still not here, so I gave up and I'm just making my commentary now. Yep, playing like a pro. Absolute pro. You know, I was playing with Ed Signs and I was uh, doing an odd voice. I don't know if I can still do it, but I was playing like a pro, sitting in the corner. And, uh, yeah, they're gonna run by me. I'm gonna sit here and get my kill streaks. Get a nuke. Tactical nuke. Yeah, I can't do it though because I just woke up. But Ed Signs can tell you. Or, what is it? Teddy? Something? I don't even know. His stupid new name that he made up. But, uh,. Yeah, so, now that I'm being a pro, um, is this tactical strategy, because it's war, and in war you wouldn't run out in the middle, or is it camping? I don't think it's tactical strategy, sitting here in this corner, and making sure I don't get killed, but also not making sure I get any kills, because, uh, who knows if anyone will ever run out this door. I thought it would be a more high traffic area than it was. But, um, this is about as much fun as this. And this, if you don't know, is Pong. And, yes, it is exactly what you think. This ball just goes back and forth, and when it gets by one of them, you get a point. And then, you know, it goes the other way, and you get a point. And <sighs> this is about as much fun as, uh, that camping was, and it's less frustrating than this game. So, back to, uh... Sitting in a corner, I'm gonna pick a new corner now, cause, uh, they captured C, so I don't wanna be over near C. So now I'm in this high traffic area, which really, usually I did seriously think that more people would be, uh, coming by here, and, uh, clearly they're not, but, anyway. Um, so yeah, I was trying to get some nuke gameplay, even though I don't like watching nuke gameplay, but people seem to like nuke gameplay, but, um... I got 24 streak, was shooting the last guy, pretty much got it, it started to pop up on the screen, and the game ended, so, basically I rage deleted that, so you'll never be able to see that, but, I'm sorry, but it was in rage, I just hit, pulled the plug on the entire recording, and it just failed, and miserably killed it, so yeah, um, let's see, I don't even know what's going on, I'm not even, like, looking at the screen anymore, uh, yeah, so, um, if you didn't already, go, uh, look at the Game Battles video. Um, since I have time, I might as well get into what Game Battles is and the whole blah 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 about the entire thing. Alright, basically, Game Battles is, if you don't know what MLG is, go on MLGPro.com. But they basically play, like, play professionally and they take it more seriously. How's that sound? And there's not noob tubes or anything, because they're all banned. Um. Now, Ed Zines is being so kind and lying in front of me. Um. But anyway. Basically, Game Battles is the amateur version, I guess. Where, basically, anyone can play. All you have to do is sign up. It's free. Um. And... I didn't really explain this in the last video that I announced it, because it was 3, three in the morning, 2.30 something and I didn't really think about saying this but you have to become a free agent to be able to join our team so become a free agent but it's free you join the team um, when I want to I will hit find a match and I'll go and I'll look for um, you know a team to play against or they'll um, challenge us and we'll play them and depending on the rules of that game you know it doesn't matter really depending on the rules what game type and whatever, but, um, 
basically it has a record and a scoreboard and leaderboard and stuff and if we are oh so awesome and we make playoffs which we won't because we're going to be a random team of subscribers meaning there's going to be no chemistry whatsoever and we're going to be running around like headless chickens but I want to play game battles and I hate joining the overly competitive teams that I don't know the people on like I don't mind if my team's competitive when I actually know the people but if they're some random guy that asked me to join his team and he's screaming at me through the mic that I should have been here or done this I'm not really enjoying myself basically we're gonna play some matches as soon as the people join and if the PC people keep begging I will make a PC ladder but or team or the PC ladder but I don't know I'd rather just stick with PS3 and 360 right now because if you didn't know I'm managing four teams which is quite enough if you ask me but maybe we can uh, work in that so yeah after you enjoyed that gameplay here's some more pong as I really did enjoy pong a lot more than the game um so yeah I'm sort of sick again here we go again I always feel half sick so whatever I didn't get up till 2 today or 2.30 actually because that's what it says on the clock um because I stayed up till 5 in the morning I don't know what I was doing well, I was working on that game battle thing till like 4.30 or whatever but why I stayed up all the way to 5 I have no idea I guess I was being an idiot and now I'm tangled up in my chair that's good a bunch of wires all tangled up and uh so yeah um I don't even know Join the game battles team though, because no one's joined yet as I'm recording this. Some guy has asked to join, but he didn't state console or country, so I... Well, I actually figured out his console, but I don't know what country, so I can't put him on a team, because I don't know where to put him. Basically, I don't, like, hate anyone from different countries. It's just the connection is the whole point. And when you're playing sort of competitively, connection really is important, and, uh your connection sucks um you're probably gonna get kicked off the team anyway just because you're hurting the team and the other people who are serious about winning doubt that any of you will be but if you're serious about winning you don't want a person who is lagging out of control and uh now captain stupid is shooting me yeah, he is so funny and everything but yeah i'm sitting in the corner oh bang i got somebody i feel like ken burton balls up what is he doing? He has like extended mags on his RPG. Uh, not RPG. D. 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 Oh, by the way, if you don't follow us on Twitter, which none of you do, but um, I tweeted the other night that I got to level 70 on my first prestige on PS3. If you didn't know, I didn't prestige for like till March or April, and I didn't play on that account after because I got the second account. And yeah, you get my point. But. So I have so much time played that I probably could have been on my ninth prestige by now, but whatever. Anyway, my point is, is that I'm on that like level that's not really a level, like between 70 and then when you can actually hit prestige. And I was playing Ground War, and I w we win a team deathmatch, and it pops up saying, "Congratulations, you've won five team deathmatches." As the challenge to win five team deathmatches. I was like, so through this entire prestige, I never won five TDMs. That's sad, because I used to play TDM Express all the time. So, apparently my teams really suck. I only won five, and I'm already level 70, and I won my fifth TDM. That is really sad, and here comes Mr. Stupid again, and now he's going to go look at the sex doll up in the little corner. Yep, up there. Okay, got that guy, because my camping is so effective, sitting on a pool table. Um, <laughs> so basically I think we'll have some noob tube gameplay, some commando pro gameplay, because, you know, this is all pros. Now, a thumbtack that I didn't know who threw it, and we got blown to pieces, no. Now I'm, uh, camping, again, on C. My nose is stuffy. Oh my god. Really is quite annoying. 
when I am sick and try to yell out commentary or try to sound like I'm interested in commentary like I want to do it but I don't feel good to do it so it's not making me happy anyone notice that Machinima has like 150 directors now only like 10 of them are known though I thought I'd just put that out there. And Hutch sucked at game battles the other night. I was watching him the live stream. Him and Hastro. Oh my god. It was bad, but... We lost. Probably if I helped out the team and didn't sit in the corner like a pro, we would have done better. But, uh... Yeah, so, um... Uh, camp away, guys. Go ahead. Or tactically sit. Uh, see you later.